This is Orange Bay Island, Egypt's paradise island with crystal clear blue water, white sandy beaches and some of the best snorkeling we have ever seen. There is so much to do on this island and it only costs £20 or $23 to go here. We will be sharing everything you need to know about this island in this video but for now we're going to be handing you over to Mubarak who is our tour guide. So hello, good morning for our guests. This is Mubarak from Paradise Travel. We are in the Red Sea today and our trip to Orange Island. Island. This is about uh, eight hours. We go and vis visit uh, the Orange Bay. Two times for snorkeling, one time for water sport. We have a lunch uh, here on the boat. Everything is available. You need to be happy and smile with us. Good day. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Our day trip started with a pickup, so yes, both a pickup and drop off are included in your day trip price. So that £20 or $23 includes both pickup and drop off, which is just amazing. And hopefully, by the end of this video, you'll see why we feel that this is such a good price, this value for price, this um, day trip. And um, there's just so much included, um, and you wouldn't really get this much. Um, on a day trip in any other country so Egypt is really good with prices um, and when it comes to um, day trips so we made our way um, to a location I don't really know the name uh, but we were taken um, from our hotel in a mini um, a van to sort of a beach um, I don't know the name of the beach but we weren't going to stay at the beach and um, the reason for going there uh, was just to walk to the place where all the uh, boats uh, dock so we walk through this beautiful um, area, very quiet, but it seems to be an area that is mostly used um, as a private beach. So there's a lot of private beaches in Hurghada or beaches you have to pay for. So there's not actually many public beaches, uh, but that's a topic for another day. Uh, but yes, we were not here for the beach. Um, we were actually there for the boat. Uh, that's our boat. You can see over there in the distance. They just did a quick check in here again making sure that you know our party's there and ticked us off on, on the list and we sat on the boat made ourselves comfortable it was a huge boat a very nice clean boat we were very impressed with the boat to be honest we were not expecting it to be this massive so really really happy with the boat overall i wouldn't actually complain just staying on here um, all day but we were using it as a method of transport to orange bay island And also, Mohammed Rusi is also our guide, okay? And also we have a cameraman here, he will take for every one person photo here in the boot and also when we go to snorkeling and when we arrive to island, he will make for every people photo session in the island, okay? So today we will speak about two things. First thing about our boot and second thing about our program today, okay? So our boot, it's name Yuma Boot, okay? Our boot name what? Yuma. Okay, here, okay, before you go in the water, you must get your towel with you because not allowed to go anywhere in the boot when you are fit. We have just one fit area out downstairs outside of salon. Then you can dry yourself and after then you can go anywhere in the boot. Okay, everything is clear about our boot today? Okay, so let's start about our program today. We will start to move to Orange Bay and in Orange Bay we will stay one hour 30 minutes there. And after then we come back to make first snorkeling and after first snorkeling we have a lunch time and after lunch time we have a second snorkeling and after second snorkeling some people they have a plus, uh, Brazilian and with Brazilian also we have water sport for all people okay yeah, yeah. so everything is clear yes thank you for your attention and I hope you will enjoy with us today in the boot Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. After some inductions and instructions, we finally jetted off and started to make our way towards Orange Bay Island. Our first stop on the itinerary. Now, some other things about the boat. And there were lots of life jackets, as you saw there. There were two toilets, and also you could grab unlimited uh, refreshments, tea, and coffee on the boat. 
um, all the times you were at the boat so for the entire eight hours and they also gave out lots of yummy lovely snacks throughout the day trip as well and um, so really truly they looked after us and again just to mention this day trip only costed 20 pounds or 23 dollars that's for an eight hour day trip which is just so so worth it um, but there you can see Orange Bay Island in the far end there and um, the colour of the um, sea um, also started to change and um, really reminding us of Maldives. Uh, we visited Maldives um, only less than a year ago um, and we really appreciated the tropical um, island but also the colour of the um, sea. Um, so just so nice to see that Egypt has something like this, just could never imagine. I um, always thought um, of the pyramids when I thought about Egypt. So this is just lovely to see. Um, but yes, after you make your way to Orange Bay Island, you get on a smaller boat and the smaller boat actually takes you um, to the entrance. Uh, there is an entrance of it at the island. <laughs> As I said before, the staff really do their best um, to keep everyone feeling happy and joyful and we just really enjoyed our company, really, really enjoyed um, the fact that um, you know we were there because they really made sure that we had a lot of fun whether on the boat, on the smaller boat or the island. But yes, this is the entrance a bit of Orange Bay Island. You walk there and then you wait in the office and then your tour is taken to a place where you can sit and relax um, and put your bags down or you can just go around and have fun. is how we spent two hours at Orange Bay Island and we definitely agree with its nickname being Paradise Island and would recommend it to anyone in doubt of visiting. Um, yes, you get given two hours at Paradise Island before you make your way back to the boat and are taken to your very first snorkeling spot which is actually very close. To Orange Bay Island it's only about a 10 minute boat ride so not far away and visibility here was great not to mention that all snorkeling gear is provided so yes you do not have to bring anything with you unless you want to we took our snorkeling masks because we feel comfortable with them and they were brand new and um, so we thought we would take them with us but everyone was given snorkeling masks and fins so you do not need to worry about taking anything with you at all just to mention this day trip cost 20 pounds or 23 dollars and again you don't have to pay extra for your snorkeling equipment so we really really want again want to emphasize that it is worth the price you pay for us at least um, but there you can see there were people with floats so there were a lot of staff members with floats in the water um, so before we went to the snorkeling spot they went around and asked everyone if you're going to be snorkeling or not and a lot of people said that they don't want to snorkel because they have never done it before so they were kind enough to take everyone uh, holding onto the float to the corals just so you don't miss out and you see all the amazing fish in the water and that's something we've never seen before we've never seen a staff go out of their way and make that much effort especially for the price you pay so really really um, admired that they really wanted everyone to have a good time they didn't want anyone to miss out on seeing the fish they took everyone out whether you could snorkel or not um, by using floats and ensured everyone enjoyed at the end of the day which is just so so great and um, after that we spent one hour on the boat having some buffet lunch food there was a lot of different types of food and we really enjoyed that as well then we made our way to the second snorkeling spot again um, really nice corals here as you probably will find in most of Egypt um, a great visibility 
After doing snorkeling for one hour here, um, we then were given one and a half hour to do some water sports activities like banana boat um, and other water sports um, activities you wanted to do before making your way back to Hurghada main town. So yes, that is what a day trip um, looks like in Egypt. For £20 or $23, you get all of this included and a drop off back to your hotel, which you will see in a bit. Um, so we really think it was worth it. We booked it through an app called Viata and it was called Orange Bay Island Experience, a day trip for eight hours, pick up, drop off and lunch included, snorkeling gear included. We really think it was worth the price and would recommend it to anyone and would do it without any doubt at all. Um, so we hope you enjoyed coming along with us on this beautiful day uh, that we spent in Hurghada um, and if you did um, enjoy watching this video um, we hope that you come back for more um, so do make sure to um, like and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already done so and follow us on Instagram where we post regular videos and stories um, and see you in the next video.